reckon just about everybody gets the fact that to be a star of stage and screen, you've got to look the part. And I also reckon that just about anyone watching this story will know who this bloke is. Come on, sing about this country with me. That's right, Troy Cassadaly. Troy Cassadaly, Ariat brand ambassador, has made his way to the beef capital of Australia, Rockhampton, for an event that stops this place in its tracks and every primary producer in the country, for that matter, every three years. It's called Beef Australia and it's huge. Any cow cocky or cattle baron worth his salt would not miss this event for all the beef in. Well, you know what I mean. It's a place to learn new production techniques, do global deals, catch up on the industry gloss in the paddock, and buy a new pair of boots. This is by far Ariat's biggest pop-up store in the country, and it's clear that the good men and women of the land can't get enough of the Ariat product. Troy Cassadaly certainly loves them. He's been wearing these black boots for a while now. When I first started with Ariat, um, I, I sort of found these boots that I loved. And I was at a rodeo in Adelaide River in the Northern Territory. And I needed new boots. And I thought, I need good yard boots, but ones that look smart enough to wear to a gig in case I need them, you know. And mate, that pair of boots have been amazing. And I've still got them, still wear them riding and everything like that. But I wore them actually onto, this, onto the, the field when we were doing something for the rugby union. I had to sing Waltz and Matilda. And I remember standing in them, just, just swaying before the, the broadcast started that I was singing. I'm thinking to myself, if boots feel this good after two days, I'm in. So that was it for me. There was a long line of different Ariat models and I got online and I was chasing some more. And then they worked out that I wore them and said, look, we can give you a pair if you want, just to sort of wear on stage or whatever. And it's been a love affair for going for a long time. Troy Cassadaly is clearly causing a bit of commotion in the Ariat store. But being the good country folk that they are, everybody's being oh so very polite and lining up for a photo. Troy isn't just here to shop, however. He is the number one attraction in town after dark, as the Beef Week locals pull up a hay bale, grab a cold drink, and get set for a very special, up close and personal performance. Rain's pizzling down. It's crazy out there, so we're going to change it up a little bit and go out there and do something a little bit more intimate, just to surprise the people. Get nice and close. Ladies and gentlemen, giving the huge beat Australia welcome. And on a night like this, with a beer in your hand and the sound of some live Troy Cassadaly music in your ears, Rocky is definitely the place to be. Beef Australia returns in three years, fingers crossed, to its rightful home in Rockhampton. Once it's official, we'll let you know. Troy's been really busy. He's got a new record out and a new book, which is well worth a read. Ariat is a fantastic American brand of boot and clothing apparel, which is popping up in better stores all around the country. Their quality is first class and their range is unbelievable. 